Hello and welcome to this short video tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how to point the DNS settings of your GoDaddy domain to iSpyHost. Now this is a very quick short tutorial um, and it'll only take you literally just a couple of minutes to do so. What you want to do is go to GoDaddy.com um, and then you log into your account. Once you're logged in simply put your mouse over the domains up here on the left and then look for in the drop down in the bottom right corner domain management okay so then click on domain management and the page is going to change for you now you should see your domain listed here but if you've got uh, several domains in your account you'll want to just do a quick search here so I'm just going to find the domain that we've used for the sample before. I'm going to open that page and you're going to see it listed now at the top here. So once you see the domain that you registered with iSpyHost, simply click on the link of the domain. Okay, click on the link. And you're going to open up this domain details page. Down in the bottom left side here you're gonna see what's called name servers okay so look for this section here name servers and if you've got your name server set right it'll look like this with the iSpy host here but if it says anything different than that click on this little link right here set name servers so I'm gonna click it it's gonna open up a pop window and what you're gonna do is there's four little radio dots here okay select the fourth one just as I have set here select this fourth dot here and then in name server number one you want to type ns1.ispyhost.com again that's ns1.ispyhost.com and then in name server two you want to type ns2.ispyhost.com again that's ns2 the number two dot ispyhost.com and once you've done that simply click the OK button it's going to submit your changes and then click the OK button once again and that's it that's all you have to do and then you can just simply click this go button here and it'll refresh your page here and what you'll see is it'll say there's no name servers on file that's because GoDaddy is replacing the original name servers that was on your account and they're gonna set it to iSpyHost so I'm just gonna click go one more time and there you have it the page refreshed and now it says name servers set to iSpyHost now just because the domain name servers are set it's still gonna take anywhere from 30 minutes to 24 hours to propagate okay so just uh, as long as you see this right here you're good to go and that is all for this tutorial